Good morning, friends. I pray that wherever in the world you are right now, that the next two minutes are a blessing to you so that you can be the blessing to the people the Lord has put around you today. So um, this week, I have to head in to um, get a little medical procedure um, taken care of. It's, um, it's nothing huge, but it's enough that it's got me a little freaked out on it's actually kind of ironic that I'm a nurse and um, I hate, I mean, I hate being the patient. <laughs> anyway, um, so this week I've just been kind of you're trying to avoid even thinking about it, but all tied up in knots about going in. And Anyway, I just, in the middle of it, I just, um, I just prayed a quick prayer that the Lord would just be with me and show himself to me. So I got a phone call from a friend this week who didn't know what was going on um, with me, and she just uh, called to tell me that the Lord had put me on her heart during her morning prayer times to pray for me, and that He wanted me to know that um, that He loved me, and that He was taking care of me, and that He was walking with me. And I just busted into tears, <laughs> um, just thinking that um, you know, here's the thing: like the Lord cares about you. And he cares about the little tiniest details in your life, wherever you are today. And um, in case you just need a reminder, I just wanted to tell you, the Lord loves you. And he is walking before you. And he is always with you. And sometimes I think we just need to remind ourselves of these gospel truths. So today I'm reading 1 Corinthians 15, 1 through 2, which reads, Now, brothers and sisters, I want to remind you of the gospel. I preach to you which you received and on which you have taken your stand. By this gospel you are saved if you hold firmly to the word that I preach to you. Otherwise you have believed in vain. So I just pray this morning that you would um, remind yourself of the gospel truth, that God loves you, and that he would stop, he will stop at nothing and had stopped at nothing uh, to redeem you. As you go out or stay in today, be the blessing. Till next time, Katie.